Here at FIU Engineering Center, our faculty and students are engaged in research that is impactful. This particular facility here uh, gives our faculty and students and the entire world an opportunity to uh, develop uh, the type of facilities, buildings and structures that would be resilient to the impact of hurricanes. The Wall of Wind project started six, seven years back uh, here at FIU with IHRC and College of Engineering and Computing. The goal was to recreate or simulate hurricanes um, so that we can study the damage modes and try to build better. The whole thing about the wind engineering team here at uh, FIU is uh, we started basically with going out to storms and measuring wind, the wind field in the storms to better understand the characteristics of a hurricane. Once that was done, we wanted to find out how, how do we bring the hurricane to the lab so we don't have to go through the storm all the time. So they developed the two-fan wall of wind in 2005. Um, from there, people got excited. We got private funding for the building and for the six-fan wall of wind. Um, and then once we developed the six fan, we were able to get a lot more characteristics of a hurricane. Typically, what, um, you, you'll, talk, you'll, you'll hear about wind separation and people are like, what is wind separation? And it's when the wind, typically when it goes over a building, you get a separation point and you get a lot of lifting force at the uh, eaves or at the edges of the building. And, those, and that's typically where the buildings are more reinforced. And you usually don't see that because it's wind. But when we do testing here with wind and wind-driven rain, you can actually see the water going over and, and you actually visually see what you read in the book. Well, the long-term impact is basically um, we should come up with research um, that can develop mitigation devices, that can uh, develop stronger products, that can enhance the building codes, that can change the perception of uh, human beings um, the, about the impact of the hurricanes. So the biggest um, impact that we want to make is achieve a hurricane resilient community. We don't want um, things uh, to happen that happened 20 years back when Hurricane Andrew hit South Florida and that's the goal that if there is a future Hurricane Andrew we shouldn't go through that much of trauma or that much of damage that we had before. So if we can achieve that I think we have achieved what we needed to.